Hello there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. So in this video, I'm going to teach you how to use WPS Office and technically WPS AI. And that being said, this is going to be the landing page you're seeing also in your end, and this is going to be the link. I'm currently inside the main page of WPS. And right now, I just want to let you know that there is no website um, platform for this one. It is a third-party application, so you should download it on this button right here. Once you click on this button, you'll have this application. And then simply click on it to have this third-party application shown on your screen. So I'm just going to enlarge it as of now. And this should be the exact application you should be seeing on your end. And that being said, you'll have the sections, for example, Tools, Documents, or rather Word Document. You'll have PowerPoint Slides, Excel Sheets, PDF, and so more. And that being said, this is actually free um, to use as of now because there is going to be a free trial. So I want to highlight the pricing to go back on their website and click on pricing. So for their one year plan, it's going to be 68 pesos per month. That will be an average of $1.50 per month. And basically, that's a very cheap plan. And that's going to be a very good deal because this is actually a very strong AI and a very strong tool to use it. So please take note of the um, promo here and the pricing. It's a Black Friday sale anyway. So by the way, WPS Office features on multiple platforms, including Mac, Windows, Android, iOS, and even web. So for features for the WPS Pro, you'll have all of this access. Not unlike on the previous version, will be ship free trial. You won't have WPS AI. You won't have this part right here. So let's go back on the main page. And for right now, let's try in documents. And by the way, guys, if you click on these files right here, you'll see everything that you have on your computer. For example, this one right here, these are the files you can check. So that being said, let's focus on on documents first. I want to click on this sample document that WPS gave us. So if I click and open, double click, it will open up Word document. And basically, if you're familiar with Microsoft Word, you won't have a problem on this platform. It's a much more user friendly than Microsoft Word. And don't be overwhelmed by this example. This is only sample from WPS. And basically with this one, you can use it as it is from how you use Word. You can edit the text by simply typing the text here and then changing the font size right on these tools right here. So 100% or let's just say 90% is the same process as Microsoft Word. And that's how you use WPS document. Now, if you pay your attention on this screen, on the upper section, you'll see this WPS AI. But for this one, this is for paid users only. Anyway, if you click on this one, it's going to ask you to sign now. Let me just use my dummy account. So if you pay attention to the top section, top right to be exact, there's going to be a button that says WPS AI. So if you click on it, you'll see this platform give you a top right section where you can summarize, explain, continue writing, improve writing, make longer or shorter, rewrite as bullet list, rewrite as table, and rewrite as plain text. Let's try this one now. For example, how about trying this specific sentence and asking AI to do this? So let's try asking him or her or it how to do this. So explain, click on explain. So it says, oops, you've run out of AI credits. So you using AI features with AI credits. And technically, this is for paid users only. Since I'm still having problems with my account, so I'm waiting for the approval of my subscription plan. I'm just going to show you how it works as of now. So basically, everything you want to summarize or rather use an AI with, simply click on that button right there, and you can choose this command. You can also type here, for example, give me a five-sentence gardening essay. Easy as that. So if I click on enter right here, it will give that error again. And that being said, let me just escape this one. Now, as you can see there, it gave me a specific five-sentence gardening essay, but let's try inserting it. And here you go. You have it right there. That's how you use WPS AI. So it actually surprised me. I can still use it via this command, but I cannot use the one earlier. And with that, let's have um, be thankful here that it's working. Anyway, that's how you use the Word document. Let's go back on the WPS landing page to try on PowerPoint now. So I'm right now currently inside PowerPoint presentation of WPS. And right now, it's basically the same thing as how you use PowerPoint. These are the sections here. You have the insert, design, 
transition, animation, and so on and so forth. That being said, if you click on specific things here, you can edit it as so. And if you're asking me where is the WPS AI for PowerPoint, sadly, it's still on Betaface. They still haven't added it up. It's only for Word and Excel as of now. Personally, PDF is much stronger here rather than the one on Microsoft. So I really love it here. So for example, PDF, you want to convert it to Word, you can do it. For convert it to images, you can do it right there. And WPS AI is also available on PDF. You can have a very strong command here, for example. You can upload your inside inquiry. You can inquire right there. It's really up to you how you use this one. You can OCR PDF. This is actually reading the text of the photo and convert the thing into a text file. How strong is that, right? You can also extract a text from images or extract text from screenshots. Now, please tell me that's not strong. And with that being said, this is the PDF version of WPS. Now, last, let's move on and try Excel now. Everything you see on Excel, Microsoft, or rather Microsoft Excel, WPS has it. And additional, it's very user friendly, it's very light. It's very snappier and faster than Microsoft Excel. Every um, mathematics equation, every formula in here is the same as Microsoft Excel, so you don't have to work around your way here. If you're familiar with that, you have no problem. And that being said, basically that's how you do it. So just want to highlight for WPS Office, you can use it for Android or even iOS or Mac devices. It's not only for um, Windows OS, the one I'm using right now, and this is going to be the link, if you not use it on other devices. That's how you use WPS Office and WPS AI. So thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button and subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Goodbye for now.